Hey everyone, it's the Bearded Reaper from the G2C Lab. Welcome back to the next adventure of Gladison. Obviously, you saw us in the last video. We just started a new character, our little Tauren dude here. And uh, basically, we are currently in Mulgore. We just arrived in Bloodhoof Village. Picked up a couple of quests. Got his professions of blacksmithing, so and mining as well to work go together. And he's got his cooking. So all we're going to do is literally just we'll continue on from where we were from the last video. Join his little adventure as he's now left his little nest onto the next bit. So if I remember rightly, yeah, we'll go to Mooring Clown Stalker. So as we go, we'll just keep going along, just just keep joining me in the journey. Like I say, I haven't joined a guild yet. Uh, hopefully, we'll join a guild a little bit later on. Might even create our own guild, and if people want to come and join us as a group, then we can all work together. And yeah, it's fair. More people got together, the better. And if you do need to find me, just search for me for Gladison if you're on this server of Nordisal, and I'm I'm sure to add you. Just let me know who you are. But anyway, right. So what was tack? Oh yeah, that's to send me down to Thunder Buff, which we don't want to do just yet. Or do we? Yeah, sod it, let's go. Help me, I keep. Bundle of hides. Are you here for the wind rider? You have some to transport? Yep. You must take these hides to Thunder Buff, then you have come to the right place. I have indeed. So for a small fee, I will give you a wind rider to Thunder Buff. There's no faster way to the city. If that is acceptable, speak to me again when you are ready to go. If you're taking those hides to Hanu, then I think he's at Howell's Armory at the base of the Windrider Tower in Thunder Bluff. And that's right where you need to land. Okay. Well, we've got quite a few little quests to do around here. So what we'll do, we'll pick up these quests first. And then we'll complete them and then when need be, we'll then go off into Thunder Bluff. Or... No, that's all right. Let's just go there. Let's just, let's just fly there so you can see the sea. Hey. So Thunder Bluff Mogul. And there we go. There's our little wind rider. Look at him, he looks so happy, doesn't he? What well, I say from like from the last video is we're gonna be doing still doing these updates. They're probably gonna be about a little section at a time hopefully it'll be about an hour so it's not too long of each section and then just literally just follow on through the horde story of the tour and when as we do we get up more gear i do the dungeons as well so when i get to level 10 i should be able to access pvp as well so i'll go into a pvp style when i will look at that so we've got here oh the thunder black quartermaster something special tabard we need to collect that, but I've only got five silver at the moment. I need to keep that going. I've got some spiced bread. Tough jerky? Yeah, see you later. That can be sold. Don't need that one. Oh, we'll get rid of that one as well. Alright. Go in peace. Let's work our way down. So is it here? No. What? It's been quite a while since I come to this city, so I have to work my bearings around as well. Oh, what's he doing? He's obviously got detention. Hello? Let's just kick him. Oh no, that's as in kick for group, isn't it? Ah, oh, never mind. Let's just give him a train. <laughs> As I knew. Peace, friend. Greetings, if you're here for level goods, then you'll find my words well crafted. Right to Thunder Buff, that's... There is dust on your shoulders, that must be from Mulgore. You have spoken with my friend Varj. Ah, a new bundle of hides. I'll get to the work on these immediately. Thank you, brother, you have done me a great service. Here are some coins to pay you for your time and travel costs. Ah, oh, thank you. 
I have prepared leather goods for Vaj to sell at the Bloodhoof Village. Will you bring them to him? If you have already been to Bloodhoof Village and spoken to their Windrider Master, then you can fly one over... Oh, la, 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 la. Start that again. Then you can fly one of our Thunder Bluff Windriders back to him. Take the leather goods to Chow, our Windrider Master in Thunder Bluff, and speak to him to arrange transport to Bloodhoof Village. So I've got to bring the goods back to Tao in Thunder Bluff. Ancestors. Yep, let's do that. Ah, oh, Dark Moon Fair is also around as well. Uh, yeah, I'd like to come and visit that, but... Too low a level at the moment. Well, we'll go back. Go back to that one another time, shall we? Let's look at the calendar. What season are we in? Ah, oh, so we just missed out on Hallow End and Day of the Dead. There we go. I said it was about 14 years. So, and then the next season we're going to is the Pilgrim's Bounty. Okay. So we'll make sure we show you how Pilgrim Bounty is. Alright, hello Tao. What brings you here? Greetings, boy, what can I do for you? Uh, I want to see my good bats. You need to take this to Bloodhoof Village, yeah? That's not a problem. If you've already been there and spoken to Tack, you can then take one of my room riders back to him. In order to fly to a town, you must have already been there and spoken with the wind rider master of that town. You've been to Bloodhoof Village and spoken to their wind master, Tack. So for, so for a small fee, you can take a wind rider to him from here. Speak with me again when you are ready. Once at Bloodhoof Village, you can then deliver the leather goods to Varj Whisperwind. Buy a windride to the Bloodhoof Village, yep. Right. Goodbye. That's what we're going to do. Peace, friend. Let's go back there. Pardon me. Fly from fly in. Right. So, back to Blood Hoof. So we're going to drop off these levers, aren't we? Back into here. A large whis wind whisper. What brings you here? Glad to see you are back from Thunder Bluff. Did you deliver the hides I knew? Yes, I did. I knew you sent me finished products. Very good. There are many hunters and adventurers in Bloodhoof Village now, and business is lively. I'm sure I'll sell these goods very soon. Thank you for all your efforts, Gladison. I am in your debt. Go win. Cheers, butter. Alright. Alright. The wars and quests. So we got here. Is that someone in here? Yep. Harkon Wind Totem. Let's speak to him. Well met. Soup hunting. The soup is a cunning bird and difficult to find and hunt. A collection of soup quills is a badge of cleverness and determination for a hunter. If you're willing to take up this task, then enter the plains and hunt the soup. Bring me their quills and bring honour to your clan. The soups may be found anywhere in Morgor, but your eyes must be sharp to spot them, and your hooves must be quick to catch them. So, we've got to get eight. Goodbye. Right, we can get eight of them, that's no, no issues. And then who's this here? What Mole Thunderhorn, eh? Hello, Mole. Poison water. Our soak of wells have been tainted, and I will need your help to fix this. To cleanse each well, I must create a cleansing totem. Then you must bring the totem to the well and perform a cleansing ritual. First, we will create a cleansing totem for the Winter Hoof Water Well. To do this, the lamb must offer its aid. Hunt prairie walls from their paws and adult plane striders for their talons. They are to the southwest. Return to me with the paws and talons, guys. We shall meet again. Okay. And then 
I've got one more hit person over here. Yep. Let's talk to this guy. Rule Eager Talon. Greetings. Eagle Talon. Okay. Dangers of the Wind Fairy. Thank you for taking the time to speak to me. I am Rule, warrior and teacher. You have obviously reached an age where you must prepare for your trials if you are on an adventure to much further out of Mogul. If you wish a test of your strength, start by seeking out the Wind Fairy Harpies to the southeast. They nestle alongside along the mountain's edges away from the road. They are one of our natural enemies here in Mogul and will be a good gauge of your skill. Alright, let's take them on. Now we've got a kill. Eight. Farewell. Gotta bring eight talons back. Oh, hello, Baker. Drawn up in the wind. No. Let's wait for this guy. Hello! Hello? Nice to meet you. Alright. We'll have to kill stuff now. May the wind be at your back. Bye. Alright, so... No, gazelles... But no, let's just build up my... Thank you. Build up the charge. Plane strider. Bosh. My tracking moon? No, I am tracking. My tracking moon? No, I am tracking minerals. That's good. Kill these gnolls as well, haven't we? Ah, there we go. How much charge? So I only get 20 seconds to use victory rush. Dare run off. What have we got here? Had a nose. Let's kill these guys off. Get a little bit of. Let's see if we can get a bit of a. I oh, know I haven't got any AOE attacks yet, have I? But let's build up a little group of them. Gauge our strength. Yeah. That's cool. That knocked out a few of them, didn't it? I'm out of range. Getting smooth so far. That's good. Right, one there. Let's get him started. Okay. I'd like to get away from this mallet if I can. Right. Little hammer, but. Like a nice big two-handed sword, that'd be good. Level six, nice, going up levels. All right, who we got here? Let's get in there. Come on, nice. So we killed eight of them so far. There you run away. Oh. And again. 
Nice. That's eleven. For this guy as well. Got three more to kill. Let's kill the Skinner. him dead. Two more to go. Good thing they spawn quite good around here. Yeah. Alright. Nice, that's that one done. Ooh. Oh, good it's silver crest. Bit of an elite monster. Let's see if we can take it out. Might kill me, but we'll give it a go. They sometimes we've got better loot. Smashed him. Oh, he gave me another little leather pouch. That's cool. Some Kodo meat, Shrinchy wolf meat. Ah, some chard. So. Cool, we can make something else shortly. I need cooking fire. We'll do that later. Let's kill this next one. He's dead as well now. How many of these you gotta kill? Six. Six paws. Got four. Hopefully, get the last one from this guy. Right. That's that one done. Still need to kill one more adult plane strider. There's a swoop. I'm out of range. So we need eight of them. There you go, another plane strider there. This guy. Have a little vulture. Right, so we've got two of them. Need six more. These boom totems. Where these come from? It's not good. I need to get closer. <laughs> Kill him, make our way there. So build up. So we've got two quests ready to hand in. Which is good. We've got to make sure what I'd like to do is try and get them all. And then we'll do a hand each one individually. I forgot how slow just running is. Right, charge! Nice. That's another one down. Smash. Groovy. It's 
too far away. A gazelle. Uh, could do the pet battles. The only problem is, well, it's not a problem, but I got all my pets for my last for my account. I've got quite a few here. So actually, yeah, let's put some level one. Let's put a little knee, knee biter in. Let's put a little yellow moth in. Let's put the wapple tinger in. And we'll try and capture this pet. Right, so it's a critter. But right, don't want to kill it. Nice. Oh. Right, let's try and capture it now. Groovy! I caught it. Ah, there's the harpies. It's their lair, isn't it? Oh, go away. Three quests done now. Got to hand them in. Wind fury, wind rich. Let's clear. Nice. So we've got to get eight talents. What have we got up here? Prairie dog. Kill that one. I can't, I can't see myself dying anytime soon. I need to get closer. Especially in the starting area. When I like approach out. Dungeons I'll yeah, I'll more likely die. What we're gonna try and do is we'll make myself a tank spec for the dungeon. Oh, got some copper. Got to get that. Let's get those veils. Oh. That's him dead. There we go. No one there. I'm out of way. Getting splattered. Like it. So copper mining. Well, I don't think I can get up to there. To where the next? What's it? Is it on here? Let's have a look. Let's try and get up here. Oh. Dead. There we go, bit of copper. Nice. Another one, go away. You're dead. So we've got to find one person there. 
more in Cloud Stalker. And it's still got to get a flat la Flatland Cougar Femur. So we're just making our way. Look at him. Bit of a brute, isn't he? Nice big open landscape. Not overly populated. It's quite good. Alright. Gotta be a cougar around here at some point. So that's where it came from. Starting area. Looks like someone could be up by that hut. Ah, there they are. More in cloud, cloud stalker. Peace, friend. Well met. If Ammo was has already explained the minor quibbles, what kind of goblin would be driving from my lands? Let's get to work. A few days ago, we found a Ventral Co caravan travelling under the guard on the northern shore of Stoneball Lake. We lost two of our number in an earlier battle, so we were quick to attack and lay waste to the caravan. We left their supply crates thinking that our torch would destroy anything of value. But given that the Ventral Co salvages have been swatted near the burned wagons, maybe we were wrong. Perhaps you'd go to the caravan and examine the contents of the crates. So we got examined some crates. Okay. So we've got to go this way. We're nearly level 7. That's quite good. Ah, oh, look at that little pet behind us, just following us. Join, right, let's get some rage. Too far away. <laughs> And some meat for cooking. So we've got a bit of rage built up. Smoke in the distance. There's Thunder Bluff in the distance as well. Still no cougar yet. There's a caravan. Oh. Ah! Cougar. We found a cougar. Found two. Let's go in there. Try the next one. Oh, there's a couple here. Got it. Alright, so we better hand that quest back in now. Oh yeah, we reached level seven. Nice. I'm out of way. Let's just kill these guys. Picking up some cloth now. So seal supply cash. All sides of the crate are stamped with the design of the Venture Co. Mining Division. Notes printed carefully on the side of the card indicate their contents are due for processing at one of their central cards. Oh! Get off me! Die! Thank you. Prime open the lid reveals a tightly packed assortment of ores and minerals. More evidence of the Venture Co.'s mining operations in Mogul. On top of the ore and minerals, you can move a tightly bound sheet of papers. Up in the foothills to the east, you can barely hear the sounds of work and see smoke rising from a large fire. So return the Venture Co. documents to more near... Okay. 
So I'm going to return the documents. Hmm, that could be over there. Excuse me. Level two now. Little battle pet. That's cool. Uh -oh. yeah. It's in the way. Are oh, there previous players? Ah, oh, bye. Gladson, have you learned anything new about the Ventur Ventura's codes, plans and operations on our homeland? If they plan to exploit our lands as they have others, the Outrunners will be quick to put an end to it. It does indeed appear that the Venture Co is intending to rob us of our natural resources. It's good to know that this is true and now it seems we must do something about it. Oh, a couple more quests. So the Outrunner's duty is to ensure the safety of those who travel across the plains of Mogul. Those that would threaten the safety of Tauran homeland with punishment of our hands. So uh, the Venture Co. This explains the build-up of Venture Co employees and equipment we've seen in Mogul. Those goblins, their company is expanding too quickly for their own good. It's how they say, show a goblin something and you can hear the scales in the background. Greedy little things they are. Unfortunately for their business enterprise, we Torum cannot allow them to conduct their operations in our lands. Go to their mine northeast of the Ravaged Caravan and send them a message. Let's uh, kill seven of them. Okay. Supervisor fits Pokemon. According to the documents you salvaged from the caravan, the Venture Co created many plans to attempt to drive us from our lands here. So they could have free reign to plunder our lands. The depths that they would sink to accomplish their goals disgust and appalls me. I want the mastermind behind their plans killed. His name is Supervisor Frizz Pocket. You will find him at the Venture Co mine east of the Ravage Caravan. Bring me his clipboard. We shall see if we find out anything else useful. Be careful. What are they taking on? Level 13 bird. <laughs> so let's head up here. Yep. There are all those question marks all ready to be handed in. No, don't want to speak to him. So what we want to do, we want to turn that into trade goods. And now let's sort that out. That's good. <laughs> Is she hot? So there's got to be some people here. Already up there, killing. Let's enter the mine. Oh, it looks like people would have been here and killing everyone. Mm, 
I think I'll be on the outside. Or do I need to check on the inside, I wonder. Well, there's a camp here. Ah, there we go, there's one. I need to get closer. There we go, there's a couple more. Let's kill that ogre. Right. What got here? Another one there, nice. him off. Where's the old mining node then? There it is. That was good. We got anyone else? Any others here? Oh, Flatland Cougar. Probably in the mine. Ah, there's one. Let's go in the mine. to put to rest. But in the meantime we can get some copper ore. Build up the supply. Nice. Charge! So he survived it. Ah! 
fight my way out now. now. Bloody supervisors. Reply back. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Oh shit. <coughs> That's right, it survived. Let's kill the cougar. I'm out of range. Now get the old victory rush. What's he doing? Tommy. Thank you. Who's that? Sewer man. <laughs> so what we'll do is hand these quests in, have a little bit of a cook up. Oh, any new materials we've got, and if we can find a forge, start doing some blacksmithing. If I've got enough stone, I've got a bit of copper now, no? 14, so it's not a great deal, but it's enough to get started. Ah, yep, we can add that. Yes. I don't think there could be too much misinterpreting or ignoring of that signal. Hmm. The Venture Co will know not to take the tour lightly or be so arrogant as to believe we would, we would allow them to steal the natural resources around us without protest. Nice. 50 achievements completed. I see from anger at the thought of atrocities the Venture Co is willing to perpetrate against us in the name of profit. My anger is somewhat lessened at the news that the villain Frisk Rocket is dead. I'll go through his personal effects and see if there's any additional information about what the Venture Co has planned for future. Thank you for your efforts, Gladson. Go in peace. No worries. Sorry to get executed. Attempt to finish off a foe causing up to 60 physical damage based on rage spent. Only useful on enemies that add oh, less than 20%. So that's a, a finisher move then. Right, let's move that to there. 
Actually no. Put that down. That one don't even need that one anymore. Because that's an auto attack. Let's move that around. So I've got a few things. Oh. And that's general stuff. Bloody village. Get in there. Level eight already. And this is only one small section. Right. Uh, I've been expecting. Do you have the pause and talent? Yep. You have done well, Gladson. I will take these and bind their power into a totem of cleansing. I have crafted a totem to cleanse the Winderhoof water well. Now you must take it to the well and perform a cleansing ritual. The well is to the southeast, but be warned. Whoever did this may still be laying there waiting. Laying in wait. This I'll may escape. prove very dangerous, guys. Escape. Okay. Go. I can do it. Greetings. So, sharing the land. Gladson, it's good you've taken the task seriously. Respect to the land and its creatures is important. Death and life are a circle, a necessity. One cannot exist without the other. Take time to ponder this and do well to never forget it. Oh, got a little nice little cloak. Yay. The restless earth. Until recently, a group of dwarfs intruded on our lands to the west, carving the earth apart senselessly to search for treasure. When the very earth itself tore apart, the spirits of the land they had abused rose up and took their revenge. The agitated earth spirits still roam the former dig site, Gladius. We must offer their appeasement. Take this drum with you to the west and play to the spirits. The river may calm their fury and confusion. So, you six. Okay, so I've got to do the drums on six people. And then we get to choose. Ancestors watch over you. this guy raw eagle talon what brings you here the wind furies are deadly foes their strength in battle is only rivaled by their desire for fresh meat you have done well you seem well prepared to travel onward let the wind always be on your back <laughs> why thank you uh, I might get to level 9 after handing in these two quests Greetings. Have you found the swoops? Do you have their quills? I know that gathering these quills is not an easy task. In doing this, you prove that you are a warrior of merit. It's good to have you at Bloodhoof Village. Farewell. Yeah, not too shabby, thank you. Right. Oh, riding trainer. Ah, uh, level 20. Level 8, about to turn level 9. The winds guide my fever grows worse and I find my mind drifting into delirious nightmares. I should have known that I wouldn't be able to handle a beast my grandfather was unable to defeat. Do you have the ingredients for remedy? I fear I do not clean the infection soon, it will be the death of me. Yeah, I do. Ah, oh, thank you. Using the items you brought me, I'll be able to create the remedy I need to stop the spread of the infection and eventually cure it completely. I owe you my life in thanks. But I'll never forget that screeching call when Mazranchi came up upon me. The blaze of its colour as its beak descended. Be wary of your travels. May the eternal sun shine upon me. Got some gloves now. Level 9. Need to go and sell some bits, don't we? Yeah, sell them to the Komodo mount. Hello. Hey. Right, sell, 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 yeah, sell. 
Right, let's look for... Walk with the earth. A little fire. Or oh, is there a forge somewhere? There's a bonfire, so we'll start cooking. Sell those ones. I'll keep that one. Be but I need to find now. No, I need a forge. Is there a forge around here? There's a mailbox. Bandage trainer. What brings you here? Winds be at your back. The eternal sun shine upon you. I see in. Is it in here? Maybe. Is there a forge in here? Hmm. Brazier. Trainer, skinning trainer, leather working. Oh, I guess there's no metal work trainers. No worries. Right, let's go and clean this well and then rest. Let's get those spirits to rest. experience well, there's the well up ahead ah <coughs> oh, fuck off Question. Peace, friend. The Grim Totem, Molskars. I hope to see the end of my days for Tor and attacked another Tor and senselessly on the very plains of Molgor. But be proud, you have done a great thing for the land and for our people. There is more work to be done. We must create a new totem to cleanse the Thunderhorn well. We must gather the claws of the predators in the Mogul Plains. 
Han prairie stalkers will have stalker claws and flatland cougars will have cougar claws. They return to me. You'll find the prairie stalkers and flatland cougars to the east and west. So I've got to get six of each. Oh. scaly now. So I've got well I've got to go both really both directions. Let's head this way. Yeah. And then we'll cross the river. Find my dog. Yeah. Greetings, traveler. Help! My prized puppy Kyle has run away. I just know he's running around Bloodhoof Village, lost and hungry. Will you find him and feed him? Once he eats, he'll settle down and come home. To feed him, you'll need Where fine food. His favorite meal is tender strider meat. Just venture east, and you should find plenty of striders. Hunt one down and take it to take it suck of meat to Kyle. And when you see Kyle in town, put the meat down and he's sure to come to you. So, we've got to feed the puppy with strider meat. Go in peace. We've got to go this way anyway, so... There we go. Cougars. I could go. It's too far away. Come. It's 
full blown smash that is. And there's the dig site up ahead. I'm out of range. Yeah. Let's dig site up on that hill. training sword but it's better than the other one. Like agitated spirits. Right, he's he's calm. Right. Soothe. guys out. Find two more cougars. Feed that little dog. And then we can fix that well. Aha! Flatland cougar. It's too far. No, no, no. Don't kill it. Just the last second. It looks better with a sword than a mallet. Then. somewhere. There we go. There's one. And charge. Just, just smash. It's literally just smash. Good turn. Mm. Oh, 
lot. See how grim Titan. Gotta find that dog as well. Kyle. Run back to Blood Hoof. So like I say, yeah, if you know, if you enjoy this sort of thing, right, come and join, join us, join up with us. If you're on Nordsoul server, just come and add me. Uh Gladison. Oh. Also if you like these sort of videos, just let us know in any comments down below and that. Because more you put into this then uh, then I can know exactly what you guys like and enjoy. I enjoy doing stuff like this, so I'll just go keep uploading. Still doing the story, show the story in a different element. Like I say it's not a speed run, it's just a chilled sort of gameplay. But for those people who may not know what Warcraft's like, or think, oh no, it's not for me, it's just to show you actually, it's more than just what some people would show it as, it's not just all mayhem. There is actually a bit of a chilled element to it as well. Greetings, so, right. Gladson, do you have the claws I sent you to gather? The Thunderhorn, Thunderhorn water well grows more tainted with each passing hour. Thank you, Gladson. The purity of each which these beasts hunt is vital in the creation of the next cleansing totem. The Thunderhorn well is a symbol of my own tribe, and to know it's being desecrated by our own kind raises a fury in me I haven't felt for years. The Grim Totem. Grim Totem are a tribe that believe all Kalimador should belong to the Torn alone. Their hate and anger are led to a corrupting thirst for power, Magatha. Their leader poisoned our High Chieftain, Calm Bloodhound. Uh, Calm Bloodhoof and attempt to take Thunderbluff for herself. She was defeated and the Grim Totem exile. Now they seek to ruin Mogor itself as they are driven out. Quickly, and you must go to the Thunderhorn water well in the north and perform the ritual. Okay. May the eternal sun shine upon thee. Right. Well met. The land is clearly clearly still in great upheaval if it took such effort to calm. Remember this. Do not forget seeing the face of those who would scar the earth, mother. Oh. Let's Goodbye. go for that. Bye. Should be a little dog somewhere. Ah, there he is. Where's he gone? Wait, come here. Stop. Nice. Hey. Let's dance with him. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Well, ladies and gents, that's the end for this video. Okay, so we're going to drop ourselves back into the inn, just so we can get some rested XP. It says, if you can remember where the inn is. There it is. And what I'll do is, I say, hope you enjoyed what you saw, and we'll see you in the next that's video. Cool. And we've got to start cleaning, cleanse the well from the Grim Totem. Until the next time. This is Bearded Reaper from the G2C. See you later.